This is tutorial number 49 and it covers how to create a custom drawing template within SOLIDWORKS. You would want to create a custom drawing template so that you can have a consistent drawing template which either has your name or the company logo on it. To start off, let's click on Tools, click Options, click File Location. Now you're going to have to specify the file location where you're going to be saving your template to. I've already done that and for you to do that you're going to have to click Add and add the file location where you're going to be saving it to. Once you've done all that, click OK and we'll open up a brand new drawing file. Click File, click New, click Drawing, click OK. Now to edit the drawing, right click and click Edit Sheet and I'm going to delete this text here and I'm going to add my name in there. So I'm going to click Annotation, I'm going to click Note, and I'm going to click in the box there, and I'm going to type in JP Technology. Now you can type in whatever you want there. You can put a company name or your own name there. Now I'm going to highlight it. I'm going to change it to Chiller, and I'm going to change the font size to 28. Okay, I'm going to click OK, and now I've got my name in there. Now let's say I have a company logo or a picture I want to put in. All I have to do is click Insert, click Object, click Create from File, click Browse, and I'm going to use this drawing picture here. Click Open, click OK, and now I'm going to make it fit to size. I'm going to make it smaller, and I'm going to fit it in there. So now I have my name on there, and this can be your company logo, or it can be a picture, it can be whatever you want it to be and I have that there. So I've created my custom drawing template that I like. So now every time when I create a drawing, I'm going to create it on this template. Now to save it, all you have to do is click File, click Save As, and change this to Drawing Template, and we'll call this JP1. Click Save, and now I've saved this template. Now let's see if we can bring it back up. So let's exit out of this, click File, click New, click My Templates, click JP1, click OK, and I've successfully made a template. And this concludes our tutorial on how to make a custom drawing template.